Now you get between 150,000 to 200,000 clicks a day. So essentially these aren't people just looking to shop, they're also people spotting trends. Absolutely. Like, it's like a fashion magazine right now. They come to Modanisa to see the new trends, new headscarf models, and uh, to see the mix and matches, uh, just like a magazine. So most of your clientele now are in Europe and Turkey, correct? Europe, Turkey, and you can say Egypt. But you're looking to expand your appeal. You're looking to Asia. You're looking even possibly to Iran. What are the challenges involved in terms of going to that new market space? First challenge is to learn their styles and cater to that need. And the second one is the infrastructure. Uh, we have like we have 1.7 million Facebook fans, and like 200. Thousand people from Tunisia following us, but it is not easy to send them the goods. Uh, the logistics are expensive today, a little uh, more than Europe, of course, and also the payment inf infrastructure is not ready for that. But it's coming, like we see every day, uh, it's growing. What's your economic outlook for the company over the next 10 years? What I see right now is a, a great growth today and a great demand uh, because there is a 400 million women to address. I'm not talking about all of them, like uh, 1.6 billion people we are talking about. Health is women. We, I'm only, only talk, talking about a quarter of it that we can address. And uh, Modernisa wants to be the Marks and Spencer of the Muslim women uh, today and we in 10 years, we're going to be reaching 1 billion uh, turnover. So at what point do you see this company going for an IPO? 10 years or less than 10 years. And what kind of interest have you gotten from international investors? Uh, right now, we are on the venture capital size uh, right now. And also, the private equity started to uh, search for it. We are talking with serious players. Uh, around the world today, like every day we are talking to someone uh, that what we can do, what kind of uh, opportunities we can catch together, and uh, soon you'll see Modanisa on the stock exchange, hopefully. In terms of what some of the big industrial families in Turkey are doing to help that move it, are, are you seeing um, involvement from the Sabanchi group, from Koch Holdings? Are, are these guys coming in and, and helping with this SME? project going forward? Uh, they are. Uh, they started in like two, three years ago, uh, but we need their uh, more involvement from them. Like we need uh, to see their experiences. We need them to share their exper experiences with, with us. And also we need them to open doors for us. I just want to bring it back to foreign investment. Do you see opportunity for foreign investors to come to Turkey to get involved uh, with SMEs, with startups? They are right now. I see them. Uh, they are looking for opportunities right now. They are talking to us, and I know that they are talking to uh, several companies today, uh, several startups today, and uh, early stage companies in Turkey. And uh, well, you'll see a lot of uh, news uh, upcoming to five to ten years. About and Turkey. You, and where do you see opportunities in, in other spaces? You're here in e-commerce specifically, I mean, you're in fashion and retail, but in terms of other opportunities uh, in that space? What I see is the applications, the mobile applications is growing big right now. Uh, the uh, games, mobile games, it's like sometimes it goes out of fashion, but it comes back again. E-commerce is also out of fashion for, for the investment world because, because of the logistics and the, the movement and it's not easy to go uh, for profit. What else? Uh, matchmaking. Really? Yes, yeah, so around the, uh, the region, like it's like from the Isla Islamic women and uh, it's proper to get married. The, the uh, matchmaking could be a good, good. So parents need help in your opinion. They need to have more, more opportunity. Just like businesses to grow, you need more opportunity. Yes, yes. Oh, more selection. More selection for, for, uh, for each party.